In this lecture, we'll start to talk about supply chain management. It's an important area, particularly in the global economy. A major function of operations is supply chain management. This refers to the process and the management of con that connects all of the integrated parties and members of the distribution system within the company and beyond the borders of the company and the suppliers together into one large distribution system in order to satisfy customer needs. This is also often called logistics. Supply chain management includes all of the activities that are involved in obtaining, purchasing, and managing raw materials and the component parts uh, that are needed for building, company, building products, in process parts and inventories, managing the finished products, packaging them, packaging them, and getting them to customers. The supply chain integrates firms such as raw materials suppliers, manufacturers, retailers, and ultimately the consumers into a seamless flow of information about needs and status, uh, as well as flows of products from raw materials through the production processes and the logistics process to the end consumers. Purchasing, also known as procurement, is one of the parts of the supply chain. It is the buying of all materials needed by the organization. The purchasing department aims to obtain items of desired quality in the right quantities at the lowest possible cost. Not all companies purchase all, purchase all of their materials needed to create their products. Oftentimes, they can make some components more economically and efficiently than can outside suppliers. On the other hand, firms sometimes find that it's uneconomical to make or purchase any item and instead arrange to, or they might lease it from another organization. Some airlines, for example, lease airplanes rather than buy them. Whether to purchase, make, or lease a needed item depends upon the costs as well as the product availability and the supplier reliability. These are the sorts of analyses that are done in the operations organizations, how to procure your assets, what the best option is, make, buy, lease, those sorts of things. Increasingly, outsourcing has become a component of the supply chain in terms of how one manages your operations. Outsourcing refers to the contracting of manufacturing, manufacturing or other tasks like call centers and help centers to independent company, often overseas. Many companies elect to outsource some aspects of their operations to companies that can provide their products more efficiently at a lower cost or with greater customer satisfaction. In other words, they might be specializing on providing high customer satisfaction, whereas the firm itself providing the product and service may consider that as not a core competency for their particular product or service. Globalization has put pressure on supply chain managers to improve the speed and balance the resources against all of these competitive pressures. Outsourcing, once used primarily as a cost-cutting technique, has increasingly been linked with the development of competitive advantage through improved product quality or service quality, speeding up the time it takes for products to get to customers and, overall, and increasing overall supply chain efficiency. However, outsourcing can create conflict with labor and negative public opinion, particularly when it results in US-based workers being replaced by lower cost workers in other countries. These are some of the key thought processes in supply chain management. Supply chain management is one of the areas to consider when thinking about careers because it's an area that you, you always have to get customers in, get their product, get products to customers, and you always have to have customer needs supported throughout this global supply chain, a very interesting area with lots of good career opportunities. In the next lecture, we'll talk a little bit about one important outshoot, offshoot of the supply chain, which is inventories, inventories along the supply chain. We'll talk about that next.